It was a great performance. Um, we put up a lot of points. Um, particularly, we put up a lot of rushing yards, and that's one thing we want to do. And were you, how much improvement did you see from Arkansas State to South Dakota? I saw a ton of improvement, especially technique-wise on the offensive line. Um, our grades were great all across the board, and um, we ran for a lot of yards. And what areas do you still need to work on then coming into Arizona State, maybe a you know, bigger team? Um, just pass protection, um, you know, taking those hits off Nate and allowing him to stay upright in the pocket and, and make those throws. What's the biggest threat with their defense? The biggest threat? Um, the defensive line, they have a pretty good defensive line. Their, their DNs are really good. Um, um, their linebacker core is good. And they're just good across the board on defense, and they're very athletic. What do you guys need to do to counter this? Um, just come out ready to play. Um, we prepare. We prepare well. We just got to come out with intensity and match their effort. What do you expect um, just crowd-wise? Do you hear more talk on campus this week, or does it seem like more people um, are going to come out? Or to be honest, I don't know what to expect, but um, hopefully we have a great turnout. Um, it's a big game. It's a night atmosphere. Hopefully they come out and get the stadium rocking. How important is that? Um, it's very important. You know, It can intimidate the opposing team if we have great fans out there supporting us and you know, bringing the noise, especially on the defensive side of the ball and third and long. You know, that can, can mess up their communication on offense. Has it been a letdown at all for you? The, I mean, obviously you guys win, but the first two games, just not seeing the stadium as practice um, you might win. I wouldn't say it's a letdown. Um, you know, right now we're just focusing on us. Um, that's something we can't control. I mean, hopefully we can control it by keep winning. And, you know, they can come out and support us, see that we're a good team. But we're just going to focus on us right now. Is this a game, though, Jeff, where where the crowd, I mean, obviously the crowd didn't matter in those first two games, but is this a game where the crowd could could make a difference? Um, yeah, of course. Um, but I think the crowd matters each game, no matter who we're playing or what opponent it is. Um, but definitely they can, make a, they can make a difference for us. Like I said, on defense, third and long, if the crowd can get loud, that messes up offense communication. You know, I've experienced that going to stadiums and you know, the crowd gets loud. The communication is hard to make, make calls and you know, get the offense going. Also, you you talked to Corey, I assume. Uh, how anxious is he getting to get back out there and do some things? I mean, he's very anxious. You know, he's been away from football for a while. And, um, you know, one thing players tend to do, they take things for granted. And I know Corey's not going to do that when he comes back.